Epilepsy is the most common serious neurological condition worldwide, estimated to affect over 65 million people across the globe and up to 200,000 people in Australia. Approximately a third of these people will not have their seizures controlled despite the best available current medical therapies. It's also not widely understood in the medical or general community that epilepsy is a potentially life threatening disorder with the risk of dying suddenly. At least, three time, at least 40 times that of the general population, and the risk of going from all cause at least three times the general population. The most common cause of epilepsy premature mortality is a condition called sudden unexpected death in epilepsy or pseudo. And the common scenario here is that a person is tragically found dead in bed with no obvious explanation for why they died. This particularly affects young people. And it's estimated that 50 to 100 Australians each year die of sugar. In fact, the real number is probably significantly more than this because in many cases, the epilepsy cause of death is not recognised by the coroner or medical examiner. The reasons for this unacceptable high incidence of sudden death in people with epilepsy are uncertain currently. Our research groups at Monash University's Department of Neuroscience and Central Clinical School have a diverse bench to bedside multidisciplinary research program that's investigating how uncontrolled seizures can result in disturbance in cardiorespiratory function, which can result in sudden death, and to learn in ways that this can be prevented. Please join me virtually for my Central Clinical School public lecture at 6 pm on Thursday, 29th of October, to find out more. See you then.